we just launched into an American style table at Mahjong time. We're going to be playing American style using national Mahjong Li rules. Since we have eights, I think we could probably focus on se uh, six, seven, eight consecutive run, leveraging these eights. We could also play like numbers. Someone just passed us like numbers. I am not going to pay that forward. No, thank you. That's really risky. It's almost as bad as passing a pair, in my opinion. So for consecutive run, the strategy that I like to use and that I think is strong and has been proven is to pick four numbers in a range around your multiple, regardless of suit. Gather four numbers in a range around your multiple till you run out of discards, then pick a hand. That's the strategy. So in this case, we do have tiles to pass, so we don't have to pick a hand. We're building around the eights, so six, seven, eight, nine. Since the range of number tiles stops at nine, we're locked in at six, seven, eight, nine. We have tiles we can pass. It's getting a little tight. We keep getting ones. There was a little bit of a like or a uh, addition hand opportunity, but we would need four dots. I did not see any four dots. Let's pass the one, two. We need eights or nines sevens or nines okay this is a bit risky we're going to pay that forward though we need seven eight nine seven eight nine would be good the six we may give give up the six and go down to a three number range. We really don't need to though. We've got tiles we could pass and this is actually a really great pass. This is my favorite pass. A wind with an even and an odd in two suits where they are separated. Now there's a little bit of a consecutive run possibility there. They would have to be playing one specific hand though with a one, two, three, four, two suit Kong hand or Pung Pung Kong Kong convention. So one specific hand is not too much of a worry. We picked up a multiple. Finally, we built up a multiple. That took a while. So we have three tiles to pass. One three, five, one, three north, which is not too bad. We are definitely playing consecutive run. We could play like numbers with eights. Let's see what we get here. We got a two again. Okay, so we'll get rid of the wind and then we'll get rid West of this one wind. bam. Sounds the one bam wind. is a year tile. I try to get rid of year tiles and dragons early. North wind. And winds for that matter if I'm not gonna use them. East wind. We'll get rid of that. One bamboo. Okay, if we get more eights, we could even play a quint. Two bamboos. At this point, it's a bit of a long shot, though. I love quints, Three though. Three bamboos. I'll play them if I get jokers. Right now, we've got that joker. I'm kind of thinking like numbers with eights, though. White dragon. Oh, we have two, four, six, eight. Let's get rid of the six bam. We could still six play bamboos. seven, eight. Maybe Nine bamboos. pass on that. So we could still play seven, eight consecutive Pung concealed hand. We could play like numbers with eights. We could play a quint. Pung. We can get rid of this nine bam. Soon we'll Green have to dragon. decide. Let's get rid of the six bam. I am thinking that there is six a possibility bamboos. of a two, four, six, eight hand. If we get a four dot, that would Five fill a gap. Bamboos. There's one Two hand characters. in the year in the evens category that uses flowers. But we have a gap, and that gap is a pair. So that's not Eight good. Eight bamboos. Eight bam. I think we should go ahead and Kong. con it. Let's focus on 
the uh, Nine like bamboos. numbers with eights because we can Kong this eight dot. North wind. And then we need either flowers or two a red bamboos. dragon. There are two, two hands Six that we qualify bamboos. for. Let's get rid of the three. Hope that they're not three playing months. like numbers. Nope. One bamboo. So we need flowers and an eight dot or an eight bam. Nine dots. And we have tiles here that we can get rid of. Seven dots. We got the four dot. Can you believe that? Seven bamboo. That's kind of crazy. One, One character. character. Let's hold the two four because if we Nine get, dots. oh, you know what? There's three six bams out. Yeah, we need to just get rid of those. Seven dots. I should have gotten rid of that one crack. That's a year tile. If you're not Sound using year wind. tiles, get rid of them early. Especially because the biggest hand on Two the card bamboos. is a year a year hand. Especially bams and cracks. Five you want to get rid of those. As a matter of one fact, we probably should go ahead and get rid of this eight crack. One bamboo. Red dragon. Okay, there was a hesitation there. So somebody may have red dragons. Eight characters. So we got rid of the expensive tiles. We can get rid of the south next. I don't think Nine anybody wants bamboos. winds. There are two south south, two north, an east and a west. Two so characters. I don't think anyone's playing winds. Eight characters. Sound wind. I should have kept that and thrown the dragon. Eight if you're not using dragons, get rid of them early. East they wind. are a hot commodity. There are only three dragons. East wind. It just seems that people typically do not White expose dragon. dragons with Green jokers. Dragon. So I try to get rid of the dragons early and hold on to number Kong. tiles for joker bait. Number tiles Sound are win. more likely to be exposed with jokers. So White we need dragon. flowers at this point. There's one red dragon out. The like, we'll go ahead and pung it. We just hmm. need to gather flowers. So whether we have them out or not, they're going to know what Three we're playing. Dots. There's already a red dragon out. All we need to do are get, uh, is get Nine flowers characters. at this point. So fully committed, major gap. One character. We just need to draw flowers at this point. Nine dots. Get rid of any risky tiles. White dragon. We're in uh, in the middle game still. We're in the third wall. We have three more Seven picks. Characters. Then we'll be in the end game. Right now we're two away from winning, but we have a gap. Three characters. Seven dots. There's that red dragon. I should have gotten rid of that first. Although nobody wanted the red dragon. There's two red. Six there's characters. there's all four uh, white dragons are out. So nobody is Three playing the characters. big ear hand, which is nice. Three characters. So there's a joker. We need one more tile. Red dragon. So I'm going to identify this as a flower. <clears throat> one dot. If the game does not know what that joker is it will not prompt hmm. you for discards so i identified it as a flower six dots we need an eight Two bam dots. or a three bam oh no this three bam hmm. is dead actually bamboo there are two One eight bamboo. cracks out so that's a relatively safe tile we need this eight bam. Plum. Okay, this is a good sign. Yes, there are two, three, four, five flowers bamboo. are out, but nobody wants them. Six. six yeah, we're gonna need, we're gonna need a joker. There are two, four, four six, seven. There's one more, two more flowers actually. So this hand is viable, and of course we can use a joker. Five characters. We need this eight bam. I would love to draw that eight bam. Orchid. Four dots. 
There's one Eight nine characters. crack out. Five characters. Eight bamboos. Oh, wow. Two, Went four, six, win. seven. Yeah, this won't be a pure hand. There are seven flowers five out now. Went there are five win. flowers out. Oh, no, wait. Two, four, six, seven. We need, a, we need jokers. One more joker. If we can get characters. it before that last flower goes out. That would be nice. There's one joker visible, but it's a dead tile. Seven All three, three bams are out. Three characters. East wind. North wind. This nine crack is a risky tile. There's only one out. Two dots. West wind. We have one, nine two, dots. three, four more picks. Green dragon. Six dots. One character. Either way, those are equally risky. Nine characters. Uh oh. Kong. Okay. That's a dead joker Five right there. Dots. We have a seven bam. There's only one out. Oh, they got it. Okay. Well, let me know what you thought about that. I thought that was a, a good exercise in how to handle a gap hand. If you have any questions about working with gap hands and when to give up on it, just write in the comments section and we'll talk about it. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the bell when you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to maybe learn a new strategy or pick up an inside of the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next strategy theory using National Mahjong League rules at Mahjong time. May all your picks be keepers.